Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Sonali. Today I'm going to be sharing my favorite Abercrombie & Fitch purchases with y'all, as well as going over some of the things that I have my eyes on for the LTK Spring Sale. If you guys don't know what LTK stands for, it stands for Like to Know It. It is a shopping app where all of your favorite influencers and bloggers can post the exact links to everything they're wearing, maybe even like home decor, beauty favorites, all of that. Like to Know It is having an exclusive sale when you shop through the app, and there's a bunch of retailers but today I'm focusing on my favorite things from Abercrombie because you guys know I feel like I talk about Abercrombie a lot. I did a crazy huge haul in I don't remember when it was. I think it was definitely last year or maybe like the beginning of this year. I can't remember but I went crazy and so now I just have so many like good basics that I need to share with you guys as well as like denim like they're really known for their denim I feel like and also some loungewear because let's be real that's what I've been living in. I'm posting this video on April 9th and the sale goes through the 11th and they will be having 25% off of Abercrombie and Fitch. This is a great time to buy all of the things I just mentioned, cozies, basics, especially denim because sometimes those can get expensive when you don't have a promo code for that. So let's just get right into it. I'm going to be first sharing my favorite things that I've actually purchased and then I wanted to do like a shop with me kind of portion, just looking at the website, kind of checking out their new arrivals and seeing what they got going on. So let's get started. I totally forgot to tell you that you can actually follow me on the Like to Know It app. My username is so underscore gnarly. The app is free um, and I'm pretty sure Androids have it too, so you should be good there. Um, so let's get into to the outfit and my favorite purchases. So first let's start with, okay, let's do the shorts first. So these are, I wanna say they're like a high rise mom fit and I really like them because they're just like not up my butt. You see how it's just like longer in the back? That is very nice, especially now that I'm like grown up, I don't really want booty shorts. I do not need to be showing anyone all that. Um, so this is really cool because it has like a split um, right there and it's just like a more boxy fit which is very very comfortable when you're like sitting down in them and like honestly if you need to lounge around in them you can these are just perfect for the beach and just like wearing a bikini top with it or like anything with this obviously I'm wearing a bodysuit I'll show you in a second um but the one thing about these is that I feel like I can never like put it down all the way. I think I just need to iron it and then it should be fine because they were in like my shorts drawer for like forever. So I think that's just what it is. But other than that, they kind of have like this two-tone thing going on. Like the back is a little bit darker, which I think is really cool. Um, and then we'll move on to the bodysuit. I love this bodysuit and I actually have it in white and black, but this one is a ribbed texture. Let me see if I can focus. You see that? I don't even know. Um, but I love this color. You guys know I love my neutrals and nudes. Um, but this one is that ribbed texture. You really, oh, and this is a bodysuit if I didn't say that already. <laughs> it does have like the snapping thing so you can like go pee easily and everything like that. But I think this is just the perfect basic to have. Like seriously, during this sale, I'm telling you guys stock up on basics that you're going to wear often because I wear this um, bodysuit and then the white one that I have that I'll also link down below which is not ribbed like I said um, I wear that one so often and it's just easy to pair with like jean shorts or denim like long denim you know and it looks just so cute and effortless and also kind of like put together Next up, we have these cloud paper bag heathered gray shorts. They are super freaking comfortable, perfect for like the springtime, especially if you're like lounging, working from home, all that kind of stuff. The great thing about Abercrombie Basics is that a lot of them come in so many other colors. So if you don't like the heathered gray, I'm pretty sure they had like an off white and maybe I wanna say a black. Obviously they have pockets, which is always a win and they're just really comfortable. Next up is this zip up hoodie and funny story about this, it's actually supposed to be heathered gray, but I accidentally like bleached part of it and then obviously it had like a bleach like white stain. So then I just like dunked the whole thing in bleach and literally turned it white. This hoodie actually does come in white so you don't have to go through that trouble if you want a white one, but I actually wear this like on the daily. There's like a few zip up hoodies I wear, but this is like one of my favorites for sure. I honestly wanna buy it like in a couple different colors and that's another thing you really can't go wrong with like buying like just cozy like hoodies and um, pullovers, like there's this like quarter zip thing I have from Abercrombie and & Fitch and I wear that a lot too. I feel like the brand as a whole just like stepped it up over the past like two years and 
anything you buy from them like you really can't go wrong but yeah I wanted to show you guys this one because it's a basic I wear almost every single day I got another cozy item for you guys they call this like a tunic or something I guess it is a little bit longer so that makes sense don't mind the wrinkles I just took it out of my um dirty laundry so wonderful but I do have a hard time like not getting makeup on the collar just because it is white and it's kind of like not super loose around the neck but I think it's so cute especially with like leggings and just like a chill comfy look for like errands lounging around the house anything like that I saved the best for last let's do some denim I have two pairs to show you guys so this one is really cool it's just very interesting also it's really stretchy so Love that because I always wear these like out or something when I know I'm going to eat a lot. <laughs> but these are really just interesting. Like I said, like they have this like stitching down the middle um, and they're kind of like a straight leg jean. I'll be honest, I kind of like got them just to like try them out. I didn't even love straight leg jeans when I got them, but I'm really glad I did because they make me just feel like so much cooler than I am. If you follow me on Instagram, you may have recognized these pants because I swear I used to wear them in every Instagram post like in November, December. And then I literally just like had to get more jeans because I was like, oh my God, I'm like wearing them so often. Um, but that is such a good thing because these pants, I I don't know how much they are but they might be like around a hundred and obviously with the promo code it's definitely cheaper than that but it's awesome to get your money's worth and jeans are the best thing that you should invest in because you're gonna wear them so often um, so these are actually the Brie Shepard X Abercrombie and Fitch jeans and they're like a mom fit is it in focus I don't even know what's going on <laughs> okay there we go so these are like a mom fit and they still are kind of like a skinny jean but they're not like hugging me like a super skinny fit if that makes sense like I mean you guys can tell it's kind of just like looser around you know the thighs and everything the butt's just a little bit looser which I kind of like because I don't have a butt anyways it hits right above the ankles which is really cool when you like wear sneakers or any kind of like a cool shoe to show off you know these have to be my all-time favorite Abercrombie and Fitch finds. Like, I just feel like they are so flattering. And if there's anything that you buy during Abercrombie and Fitch's sales, you need to go for their denim because most of the time, like I said, they're like $100 and, you know, you could get any kind of jeans for that price. But these are, like, such good quality and when they go on sale... Like, definitely take advantage of it. That's all I'm saying. Now that I've shown you a couple of my favorite purchases from Abercrombie, I kind of wanted to just go through the site and do, like, a little shop with me. We can go through the new arrivals. I kind of have, like, a bunch of, like, tabs already pulled up. So we can go through those. A couple of the things are a little bit similar to the things I already have. But I did want to show you guys anyways in case you wanted to pick it up during the Like to Know It Spring Sale. The first one up is the Split Hem Terry Tunic Popover Hoodie. Um, it comes in a whole bunch of colors. Like I said, a lot of their basics come in a variety of colors which is great because you know not everyone loves the same color it does have that white that I had in the tunic so basically it's literally like that tunic sweatshirt I showed you just with a hoodie which is kind of cool next we have a matching set so the first one is a lounge long line bralette and I feel like this is so trendy it's that really nice like ribbed texture and I feel like in a lot of my past hauls I've gotten a lot of ribbed clothing I love it so much though because I feel like it always is like a little bit thicker so it really just holds in you know the girls and everything so I don't really have to wear a bra with it well this is is like a bralette so that would make sense but it does have matching lounge leggings and I'm pretty sure they do have um, biker shorts too so that is super cute it comes in a nude it comes in like an oatmeal cream color burgundy oh brown I guess it looks burgundy at first when I saw the bra it kind of reminded me of like something in set active although it's not like a sports bra like you probably wouldn't be able to work out in it but it's still like cute for lounging I feel like I've said this a couple of times on my channel but I'm trying to add back a little bit of color into my wardrobe just like be a little fun for the spring so I saw this set um, workout set this is actually a workout set um, and it's in this like really pretty blue color this is the contour full length leggings and they look really nice I guess it's a sports bra or like just a tank top but it kind of looks like a sports bra so I wonder how like supportive it would be but it's a matching one to the leggings and it looks so cute it's actually um, the color light lavender Next up we have these tailored shorts. I actually have the black version, which I don't wear that often because I feel like I just never wear black anymore. I don't know why, but I just, like it's a weird thing in my mind. I just never wear black. So I kind of want to pick up the cream ones or what is this color? Oh, it's an ice green. It really does look like on the cream side. When it comes to Abercrombie sweatpants, 
take all my money. They are the best sweatpants I have had. And I found these like lounge wide leg pants and they have that like ribbed texture. They look so comfortable. So I feel like I'm gonna end up purchasing this for sure. It comes in like a more like nude, light brown, um, like an oatmeal co color and then a gray which honestly the gray is like very like loungy vibes. I feel like I'm saying lounge a little bit too much, so maybe I should stop. Okay, next up we have this linen mini skirt and it has like this little cute knot twist kind of thing. Okay, I know that there's one on Princess Polly because I had it um, and it's just like too big for me. I swear I asked for a large and I think they sent me an extra large, so I'm so sad because it's so cute. Uh, but it's basically the same thing, just like the Princess Polly one is like just simple and no knot, but I think the knot's really cute and I think it's perfect for spring, just like pairing it with like other linen stuff or just like a cute like white crop top or like a little frilly white crop top thing with the tie in the middle you guys understand okay next up we have the twist front midi sweater dress and unfortunately i don't think i should purchase this because i know it's about to get like real hot here in austin texas so i will not be purchasing it but i just want to let you guys know this is a cute ass dress and if it was still like cold outside i'd probably definitely purchase this because it doesn't look like as fitted i mean it still looks fitted so it might show a little bit of those rolls but it does kind of like have that slit at the end of it so i guess what i'm saying is that it just doesn't look like a full-on bodycon which is nice for the spring okay next we have actually a bodycon dress i thought this was really cool um i feel like i haven't seen this on abercrombie at all this is the scuba cutout sweater dress and I know when they say scuba, the material is like a really good, like thick material that's really gonna just like hug you and like really suck you in. So I see that this is like ribbed a little bit, which is great. Cause like I said, ribbed is always like a thicker material usually. This wrap blazer mini dress, take my money. It comes in black too, but like I said, I'm not really wearing black that much these days, but it does come in this beautiful cream color. Like I said, I'm really not trying to purchase like long sleeve stuff right now just because I know it's not really gonna get worn because you know, summer's coming in like T minus what one day, literally this whole week is gonna be like 97, I'm pretty sure. But this might be an exception because it's so classy and just like beautiful. Then I found this waffle cropped cardigan and I feel like these like cardigan things are super freaking trendy right now. It also comes in a mint green and I know green is like a big color for spring. Um, and I just think it's really cute like to have that like off the shoulder look so you can wear like something like this like a bodysuit with the cropped cardigan and like cool jeans with like air force ones or like just any kind of white sneaker would be a really cute outfit very effortless but still like you look really cute and put together you know next top is this twist front poplin top and i thought it was gorgeous when i saw it i do think that it might be a little tight for my bigger chested girls like me so i don't know if i would purchase this but i think it's a gorgeous top like that twist looks so nice and the back looks just very elegant like it's a square back um and it has that like ruched um material in the back so it seems like a bit stretchy i just don't know like how big like the cups kind of are you know so I'm gonna pass on that for now, but it's stunning. Okay, this next top is the off the shoulder gauzy beach top. And I actually just got a top similar to this um, from Petal and Pup. So I am not gonna be purchasing this, but I think this is a lot cheaper than Petal and Pup's one. Right now this is like $30 without a sale. Um, but I do think it's just like a beach top. So I'm not sure if it's like full coverage or like what's going on there. Cause I do see that the pants are not full coverage. But if you were heading to the beach, I feel like that would be a really cute, just like throw on over your bikini if you're going to lunch after the beach. Speaking of bikinis, I'm not really sure if I'm like there yet, you know? I think I'm gonna stick to one pieces for now, but I'm definitely wanting to get to a bikini. So I just thought I would share their swim with y'all. Okay, this first one is a wide strap underwire swim top. I just really like the tie. I feel like that's another big trend in swim right now. And I saw this wide strap square neck bikini top and I just thought it was like a really nice like full coverage. It looks like very like, you know, not much cleavage, but also this girl doesn't really have that much boobs, so. I don't know if like that would be different, but I think it looks like very like supportive 
and the bottoms look really nice they look high-waisted which is great i can't find the bottoms right now but i really like the top and just like the texture it's a white color but it does have like some texture on it which is nice and then we have this kimono cover-up i love me a good cover-up obviously you know when you're walking down to the beach on vacation um sometimes you'll need a cover-up um if you're going to like a restaurant right there so that is always nice not sure if you guys know what the outdoor voice is like active dress looks like but i found a dupe it's the active mini dress on abercrombie and it comes in an olive green color which i've actually had my eye on for months now have yet to pull the trigger but i feel like this spring sale will be a perfect time to do so and then next up we have a scuba knit midi dress and this is really really cute it looks very comfortable i have multiple dresses from abercrombie and i could just see like this being like tied up at the end cute sneakers like maybe like a really light jacket like a denim jacket and i just like have a vision in my head okay i cannot get enough of like the one shoulder trend i love it so much so i saw this one shoulder sweater bodysuit i'm not sure like how thick this sweater is because i don't really want anything like too thick especially going into like a hot summer but they do have this one in white and i feel like this would be a really good bodysuit to get because since it is a sweater it'll be thick so you wouldn't have to wear a bra which is great because like i don't even know what bra i would wear anyways with the one shoulder the next thing i saw was the poplin shirt dress and i feel like my vision for this is like a cute like beachy theme so like hair in a bun maybe sunglasses oversized sunglasses really cute summer sandals and this dress i feel like is a such a look i'll be totally honest with you guys i've actually stayed away from florals in the past like year or so because i just feel like they're very trendy and i get over the pattern very easily but this one is like super cute again it's real it is really trendy <laughs> like i know i'm gonna like get sick of it um probably like two months from now so i don't know if i'm gonna be purchasing this one but i do love the green color from this dress i mean it does have like a bunch of other colors um and also like this floral is not as like obnoxious i guess i don't love like big floral patterns like i really try to stay away from the those but i feel like this is like okay i also feel like the structure of this dress would be very very flattering i'm actually on the hunt for a straw like fedora kind of thing and i saw this straw panama hat and i'm very tempted to get it it's only like 40 bucks compared to like what hats usually are i feel like hats are very expensive um but i might like go around to the austin hat shops i know there's like a bunch on south congress and like you know take a peek see what my options are and then come back to this one and then next we have the classic sweatpants like i said their sweats are everything so stock up on those two while you can that wraps up this video let me know what you guys think about this format i did like a grad dress shop with me kind of thing and i thought it was really fun you guys seem to enjoy it so let me know if you guys want more of these um and also don't forget to follow me on like to know it because throughout the sale i'll definitely be posting a lot more pictures and obviously you can shop through the app to get the sale so i will be linking everything in the description of this video but for you to get the sale you need to shop through the app if that makes sense so go ahead and download the like to know app follow me again it's so underscore gnarly without the g and also while you're there definitely go follow all your other favorite influencers because i know that they would appreciate it too and they're probably going to be posting a lot about the sale too so you can get a lot of inspo from them as well but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see y'all in my next one bye